Hello everybody and welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial we're gonna look at this mirror ball deformation. So I was scrolling through my Twitter feed and then <laughs> Let's do this. So the first thing that you need is obviously to import the NVIDIA Flex plugin from the Adset store. It's for free. And then you will have this flex samples. You can you can go through all the samples and look at them and stuff. What we are going to use is the cloth uh, the cloth deformation. And so let's set up the scene. Let's go ahead and create a plane. Uh, rotate it. Let's make it this way. And then I have this. HDRI texture which I just downloaded from one of the like if you google uh, HDRI free you will have all kind of websites that allows you to download for free so download this thing and then just create a material and choose skybox panoramic and then you can assign this texture to it and then you can go to the lighting and just assign that to your skybox material you will have your hdri texture as a skybox all right what i did also is i just created some materials this is just a black material and we probably don't need the light because it's gonna come from uh, the hdri and let's go ahead and I, I already made um, this dense ball in blender and you can see that it is dense it is like 3800 vertice, vert, vertices um, so remember to enable this read write enabled and then throw it in let's reset the transform remember that you have to have a scale of 111 and it's obviously black because there is no light and let's hmm, that's funny um so i have this let's call it mirror which just a metallic of one and smoothness of one which will act like a mirror so I think we need to generate the light maps let's call it scene now you will have your your skybox baked or something like that so your uh, your mirror material will look like this it's just as i said metallic one and smoothness one you can have some different smoothness if you like uh, but i like this so after that you just go ahead and type in clo and you will have cloth deformation which will add two scripts this will be assigned to the object itself by default and then let's throw in our container right and then here I, I just duplicated uh, the flex cloth asset and I think it's this one and then I assigned this icosphere to the reference mesh which will make this thing um, I also played a little bit with these but it's not that big of a difference and then let's assign this to the script and it's worth noting that I changed some of these so I made this uh, advanced options and then the, cre the, the gravity is zero I don't want it to move um, and I changed 
the I increase the friction, increase the damping. Um, you can you can play with these uh, however you want. You will have some different results. So if you now create a sphere. Let's make it smaller and let's try this. Very nice. I also made another um, another one which is half. So I'm just gonna do the same steps, reset, bring it here, and let's rotate it. Let's remove this for now and add the cloth formation, throw in our mirror material. And I already did this cloth asset for it and drop in the container and come on nice you can also add like um, an empty and drop the sphere below it and create a duplicate of the sphere, bring it like this and let's remove or disable our mesh renderer and you can put it there like so and then Let's get our camera here. Let's play that. Come on. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button as well. You can support me by getting my uh, assets on the asset store. The link is in the description. Have a nice day.